Hey guys, it's Jade and welcome back to another video on my channel. So in today's video, as you guys can probably tell by the title above, we're going to be doing a what is in my purse video. So this video is very, very proudly sponsored by Teddy Blake Designer Handbags. And y'all, I literally cannot even believe that they want to sponsor one of my videos. It's actually insane. If you guys are new to Teddy Blake, they have incredible designs. Like y'all, I will have my bag plus their website linked down below so you guys can see all the incredible designs that they have. They are premium Italian leather made by experienced craftsmen. They're truly made in Italy, which I think is totally amazing. And um, they actually be, are able to bring that true luxury designer handbag to the average consumer. With Teddy Blake, you always get a fair and incredible price for the quality of goods that you get. They seriously have such a designer and luxury feel they are designer and luxury they just take off that one to two thousand dollar markup that a lot of times happens on real designer bags if you guys are new to my channel make sure to subscribe down below as well as give this video a big thumbs up if you liked it now we're gonna hop right on in because I don't want to keep this intro too long into the contents of my purse all right, guys, so this is the bag that I use. This is, again, from Teddy Blake New York. I love this little keychain they put on there. Sometimes I have that on there, sometimes I take it off. It depends on the day. Um, but this, I will go ahead and say, is not the purse that I carry to class, not the purse that I carry on the everyday basis, but this is definitely my, like, formal, nice bag that if I am going to an interview or even going downtown to work on some schoolwork or work on some business stuff, like, this is the bag I'm going to carry. I absolutely love this beautiful beigey taupe color. I don't know if it's showing up on camera as beautiful as it is in real person. And again, the quality is incredible. It's real leather. It's got that nice leather suede in the inside, which is amazing. This bag is a really great size. Like it carries a lot of stuff, but it's not too massive. Um, and it just has so much space in the inside. So there is a lot for me to show you guys in here. And it does have two little handheld straps here, but also, and usually I carry it with me. Yes, I also has. Hold on. A little shoulder strap that you can attach to either of the sides as well. Now going into the contents of the bag, it's kind of divided into three sections. We have this little front half, a zippered pocket right here to mediate, and then another one of these little back pockets. Starting in the back, I first have my iPad. So I have been loving my iPad recently. I have been using it to take all my notes for school, do so much of my business work for YouTube. Obviously I cannot edit on this, um, but I can pretty much do anything else that I need to do behind the scenes for YouTube on this bad boy. I literally Really love this so much and also if you guys are wondering this really cute sage green case is from Amazon um, if I can find a link I'll also put it down below but I might not be able to find it because I've had it for a while the next thing that I keep in my purse is actually my planner this is a Webster's pages planner and I have showed this a ton on my channel I know um, but this is just my super cute a5 ring size planner it's got daily sections I keep track of like my health and groceries and fitness and stuff a finances section a section dedicated to YouTube just for you guys and of course just my daily planner in the back I literally have to have this planner with me at all times it is my pride and joy and my baby so I love having a bag big enough and sturdy enough to carry this big hunky boy and lastly for this just back section I just keep the charger for my iPad um, sometimes I'll throw in my computer in here an extra notebook my Bible depending if I'm going to church or something because I do use this bag a lot to go to church as well for the most part those are the staple items that are going to be staying in there in the little middle zippered section it has a lot of room I just for some reason don't have to use this pocket a whole lot the only thing that I keep in there are just some disposable masks I love these little black disposable masks from Amazon again they are amazing we love Amazon um, and that's pretty much what fills up this entire pocket next moving on to the front little third of it this is I think where I keep the most stuff um, we first just have my keys really not too basic kind of going into some things about my keys because I don't think I've ever really talked to you guys about where all my little things are from and honestly I really love my keys so love that for me first we have this little Louis Vuitton keychain it's not even like necessarily from Louis Vuitton but it's made from this really cool seller on on Etsy um, that um, reworks old Louis Vuitton bags into keychains into different stuff and so I love this bad boy I've kind of got like a neutral brown theme going on with my keychain if you guys can kind of tell um, love that I then also have obviously the key to my apartment and the key to my bike lock and the key to my car and stuff like that but that's not really important to share. The next thing I have on there is this cute little strap. I kind of use it as a wrist strap. It is from Hobby Lobby of these little wooden beads. Next keychain I have on here is this really adorable little um, 
what is this called again? Tortoise shell. Um, little J letter also from Hobby Lobby. And then lastly, we have a little threads wallet that holds like my credit card, my student ID, my driver's license, my insurance card, just the basic cards that I feel like I always need. And I love being able to have all of this on one little thing. Cause again, honestly, half the time, I don't even carry a bag with me. And I take my phone and this bad boy and I'm good to go. Next up, I just carry my sunglasses with me. These are a pair of Ray-Bans. I cannot exactly remember the exact style, but for your reference, this is what they look like. I love these guys, they are so nice. Definitely an impulse purchase I made a couple years ago and definitely unnecessary and definitely regret spending that much money on a pair of sunglasses sometimes. But they are nice to have now and I do get my fair share of use out of them. Then I have this little additional wallet that's super cute little like silver wallet with gold stars on it um, that I house gift cards and cash and stuff like that that I don't really always need with me. That's why it's not in my threads wallet on my keychain. But it's nice to have when I actually bring my whole purse around like if I'm doing a big shopping day and I want to use my gift cards or cash or anything like that. That goes in here. And lastly, we actually have this little pencil pouch that houses a ton of just everyday essential stuff like that. So I'll go kind of quickly through everything that this contains. In the little front pocket, you guys can kind of already see them, but pretty much it just houses a couple different pens. Like I said, I feel like I, I bring this bag to church a lot and this little pencil pouch kind of gets changed between my bags depending on which one I'm using that day. Um, and so I always need to have pens when I go to church because I like to take notes. Um, so love to have those in there. In the main section though is where we have most of the goodies. Um, we have feminine products. Love that for us. We have this really janky looking bag of medicine but it's pretty much just got Claritin, Midol, Advil, and Advil PM to cover all my bases. I have a couple different flavors of gum. I have another disposable mask, just in case I don't have any of the black ones with me. I've got my little wireless headphones. These are my sole wireless headphones. I love them so much and I love having them with me. I have this cute little mini hand sanitizer. This is actually a keychain and it used to be on my keys, but it was a little bit too bulky. So now I just put it in here, but this is so cute and it is from, um, Altered State if you guys want one. I've got clips and scrunchies and hair ties and all sorts of stuff like that. I've got a couple more extra pens and that is pretty much it for the essentials bag. All right guys, so that is pretty much everything that is in my Teddy Blake bag. That's everything that I carry with me in my purse. I know that this video was pretty quick and really not that climactic, if I'm being completely honest, um, but that is pretty much what I keep in my bag. I absolutely love Teddy Blake and I would highly recommend you guys, if you guys are looking for that designer luxury bag feel without having to have that incredibly high price markup of a lot of other luxury brands, Teddy Blake is absolutely the way to go. This is my first designer item and I will cherish this for the rest of my life and I genuinely think it will last me the rest of my life. They make incredibly beautiful bags. They have big tote bags like this, but they also have more informal bags or smaller crossbody bags. They also have backpacks and again, all with that genuine Italian leather that is made genuinely in Italy. And y'all, I know I've mentioned this a lot, but the price point of these is so, so, so good, especially for the amount of quality that you get. And I wouldn't recommend companies like this on my channel if I didn't truly believe in them and I didn't truly feel like they were worth your money. They have a ton of color options, a ton of style options. They will have something that you guys will like if you're interested in getting a designer bag. So again, a huge shout out to Teddy Blake for sponsoring today's video. I feel very honored for you guys to want to sponsor a video of mine. And yeah. All right, guys, that is going to be it for today's video. If you liked it, please give it a big thumbs up as well as subscribe to my channel down below if you guys are new. Again, make sure to go over and follow me on Instagram. It's just at Jade Benward. That's where I keep up with you guys the most. Make sure to look in the description box down below for all sorts of coupon codes and fun information and stuff like that, as well as a link to my Teddy Blake bag will be in the description box down below, as well as just a link to Teddy Blake's website in general for you guys to browse all the different bags that they have, learn more about them as a company and all sorts of stuff like that. I'd also encourage you guys to go over and follow Teddy Blake on all their social medias. Again, I'll have those linked in the description box down below for you guys' convenience. I think that's going to be it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that y'all enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys. This is someone. This is someone.